Okay, right now our next period of time is going to be our jungle batting practice. I talked about the zoo and the jungle inside. Uh, the jungle is real and it's real uh, realistic situations that happen in a game all the time and there's no redos. And today we're going to show uh, runners at second base and the hitter has one swing to move the runner over. If he does that successfully, then he'll go to third base and the infield will be in. So we're going to see right now if they don't do that successfully, they have to leave um, the cage. So they have one swing right now to do to get move the runner over. So he moved the runner over successfully and now he has a runner at third base. Infield's going to be in. Infield in! Infield in now! Infield in! So it's a great way, uh, we call it the jungle BP um, and we, we, we have a lot of variety with that. So he did the job there. He was two for two. He executed it very well. So now the situation again. Runners at second base. Um, he has to has one chance to get the job done and to move the runner over. He, ex he had that down the line, so that works. It doesn't have to be a traditional ground ball or move the runner. It can be, a, you know, obviously for guys in this group or, or power guys, we want them to drive the ball out of the ballpark, hit the ball hard in the gap. Um, so it's a way for them to focus on situations that happen to them. I think one thing during, our, during this period of jungle batting practice, um, the players really have to embrace who they are as a hitter, understanding what they do and how they have success. And success can be done different ways. And for this group, it's more of a, a, a power group, our, our power guys that um, can drive the ball out of the ballpark, hit the ball very hard, and um, it allows them to, to lock in on, on the one pitch for that period of time. So they've had a good job of moving the runner over and then driving them, driving them in. And So now the infield will be in. He successfully moved him over in the gap. And so that situation, he, he might have scored him. We just don't know. It's hard to tell. But you know, normally we'll have our live defense out here. We have some guys out here today. Uh, but it's a great way. So again, jungle batting practice. Uh, any, any situation you want. I mean, you can infield back, infield in. We can bunt. You can hit and run. Whatever it is that works for you uh, in your program, you can do. And I think for us, we, we, do, we vary it depending on what group we have uh, each time that we do it. it. It may be a day two where we have a you know shorter day of batting practice. We only have a few minutes, but we can really get some good uh, quality at bats and quality content um, for our players within an intent of what we want to do.